This is our country. Uh, it is a very good country. It is a country that actually developed the principle of parliamentary democracy. Uh, it has been given away uh, through a whole series of lies and deceits. And even if the common market might have been a good idea 40 years ago, it's certainly hopelessly out of date now. Let's take back control of our country. Let's control our borders and have a proper immigration policy. Let's stop giving away £55 million a day as a membership fee to a club that we don't need to be a part of. Let's re-embrace the big world the 21st century global world. Let's strike trade deals with India, New Zealand, all of those emerging, doing superbly parts of the world. Let's free ourselves up. And in doing so, let's give an example to the rest of Europe. I know the people are behind this. And I'm, I would urge people, come and join the people's army. Let's topple the establishment who've led us to this mess. So it's time for you to choose. There are people like uh, Nigel Farage who shun the modern world, I want to turn the clock back to a world where it was all so much more simple. I don't know. Britain had the empire. Women knew their place and stayed at home. People who were gay were not allowed to get married, where we didn't have to deal with complicated things like climate change. And then there are those of us who believe, who believe and love modern Britain as it is today. Compassionate, diverse, outward-facing, who understand that there are complexities and challenges in the modern world, but who also understand that by working with other countries, we deal with those challenges and we make Britain richer, stronger and safer. In short, real remedies for the way that the world is today, not dangerous fantasies about a bygone world that no longer exists. And that is why I'm going to do everything I can to make sure that we remain part of the European Union, because that is how we protect the Britain that we love.